That was my first introduction into Godzilla, the 1978 cartoon where Godzilla is nothing but a hero. The humans had a little friend called Godzuki who would call upon Godzilla whenever they were in trouble. Godzilla would then appear, help the humans out and then he'd disappear. Rinse and repeat for most of the cartoons but it worked. There has been many iterations of Godzilla throughout the years, some good and some just well. God damn awful. Nani sore? Some were evil and destructive, but others were <laughs> just plain hilarious. And when I say hilarious, I mean hilarious. Watch one of Godzilla's signature moves as he fly kicks his enemy. Not once. He takes a run up. And he goes for the second time. Bra! <laughs> Go Godzilla. Go Godzilla. Then, in 1998, Hollywood decided to release what can only be called an abomination of a movie. An absolute abomination. Despite making $350 million worldwide, this film was considered a flop. And let's be honest, everybody that saw it thought it was awful. Absolutely awful. After that, would Hollywood ever try again? Would they? Would they risk making another Godzilla movie? But they did. <laughs> 